So we just met a really lovely woman called Sam. Oh, who is it? I knew that we'd have to expect a lot this Ramadan. Ramadan so shopping. It's so boaty outside when there's crap. Arms are full. Shopping we are. Obviously got all the healthy kebabs and uh, samosas. What were we in? Oh, this is where we put the jaru last time, remember? Yeah. Don't get people in it. For Pakistani drinks, maybe? Yeah, Rubicon Mango. Good deluxe. One, two, three, four. I declare a thumb war. Yes, we got four lights on, but we need it. You can't I, see who, who, got, who got a ring light for your birthday? Oh, am I supposed to put that in the kitchen? Put it wherever you need to put it. That actually uses more voltage, actually. So, yeah. So, come on, let me vlog. I see some stuff melting. Exactly, put it away. Melting. It's melting. Go on. No, I'll be fine. Thank you. Can we see the cat? Uh, yeah, just feed the cats, that's it. No, I'll do that. Just feed them. Just feed them. Feed them. No point because then. Feed be... them and then I can clean it after they're done. Feed them. <laughs> okay. Hey guys, so yeah, weather's rubbish today, which is probably good news for fellow fasters. Uh, but here we are, day two. I'd like to say it's getting easier, but it. Oh. Uh, so we've just been shopping so I just need to put this away because we bought okay, some frozen food. Okay, food. Let's go on food. This is okay, how they know they're getting fed. So we just picked up Marcus, I'm doing the, the hole. So we picked up these meat kebabs. Let's these are really bomb. Marcus, I'm gonna kill you. So basically you just put these in the microwave, they're great, really tasty and just take like a couple of minutes in the microwave and they're done. Why Can't be too good for you, they'll see kebabs. But they're nice. More samosas. Marcus don't like these samosas, but I do. I prefer them over homemade samosas sometimes. The chicken okay, steaks. Okay. These chicken steaks, what Marcus and I like to do is actually put these in pitters and then we put like loads of salad and like some mint sauce and oh, it is so what, good. Oh, yeah, and cheese as well. What cheese? What do you want? Halloumi cheese to die for. Just more bratte because that is all he'll be living off. There's no way I'm practicing my uh, roti making skills in Ramadan. So I need to make more room in the fridge. Excuse me, Nath. Let's some biscuits. Our freezer is very, very full. I don't know where I'm actually going to put this stuff. Uh, you know what? You, you think, oh, this is like such a big fridge freezer. We're going to fit loads in it. And half the time we were worried, like, oh, it'll be empty anyway because there's all two of us. But literally, a lot of light is full all the time. Half of this cake and ice cream. Yeah. That's only a white people thing, okay? My mum never said to me the house is like Blackpool Illuminations growing up, so I don't know what you mean. I never liked Blackpool, so it's more of a key thought skill. I've managed like Tetris these in somehow. I'm not even going to show you my freezer because it's pretty embarrassing. My sister's invited us to eat, so she made chicken pakoras and everything, so. Not that I have to do anything tonight because I made curry last night, so I'm not wasting that. I'm gonna have that again tonight. Yeah, and uh, Marcus is turning it down because he's tired. We're doing some free food. So I've actually just come up and we're gonna Mark help me do the bedroom, bless him. So my sister is playing all these mind games because she got my niece, Raya, who we both can't like say no to, to message me on Snapchat. Well, she made it look natural, saying, Hello, so you're gonna come to eat, we've got your birthday present as well. So obviously we're gonna have to go on out and do iftari there, which But yeah, so she's, Marcus, you love her chicken pakora, so I'm sure we'll be fine. I'll drive too. I'm such a good wife. <laughs> Any other ingredients? What else does she want? Any other ingredients? Cheese. Yeah, we need to get that parmesan cheese. Parmesan. No, we can't get parmesan. parmesan -y. Oh, like parmesan, but not parmesan. You can't have parmesan, it's got animal rennet in it. We didn't know this until a lovely lady messaged me whilst I was in Italy having parmesan. Do you like a parmesan substitute? Basically, it's the second day guys, and well it's the third day of fasting, but we are just 
at Tesco so we're gonna nip in to get some ingredients so we originally nipped in just to get some drinks and stuff to take to my other sister's house who invited us down to open our fast with her today and then we mentioned that we're going to Tesco's and she's given us a whole bloody shopping list so now we're gonna have to do that Yeah, we're actually here now, like doing a lot of shopping that was unplanned. Um, so we're gonna have to go in, and we are so drained for energy. I'm so sick. I'm not sick, but I feel sick. You know. And yeah, she's gonna try and make that pasta, isn't she? That we had in Turkey. Oh, it was so good. We I'm had it like it. four times, huh? I'm gonna make it. You're gonna. Make, are you gonna make it? No. Ah, uh, oh, well, Marcus is gonna make it then. There we go. And also she can make chicken wraps and chips because Marcus wanted that. So although I'm not cooking, I will show you cooking because a lot of you said that you like cooking. Oh, by the way, can you see, actually see how tanned I am now? Look at that. I didn't think the camera would pick up that well, but I'm actually really, really tanned. It's ridiculous. Go on, not that long. Go on then. I'm not going on my own, Marcus. I'm not Why? doing it. No. Come on. Well, you can't even go to Tesco. Then, right? No. What did you do before What do you think I got married for? For support? Can I have my bag, please? You can't do anything for yourself. For God's sake. <laughs> so, what? Drained, yeah. Did, so, uh, basically, when you go to someone's house to open your fast, you don't go empty handed. <gasps> can you see that? I don't know if you can see it, but it's like a thingy there. But you don't go empty handed. So, we're obviously going to buy some stuff to take to my sisters. Even though when it's family, it doesn't really matter, but you know, still. I think it's this one. This one doesn't say animal in it. Alright, bang it down. The Cinnabon, don't give me a heart attack, Marcus. <gasps> Ooh, cheap chocolate. Take one of these because are you an Asian if you don't give Ruka Mango to someone? Oh, yes, Tagliatelle. My favourite. I reckon you want to be enough, but we're not paying. What was that? Kick some it. No, well, no, it weren't mine, was it? No, it was. Has it? I should have tripped over it. We could have done with the money. Had in ages. What? Shreddies. You know what? The funniest thing is, you wouldn't even be on about all this food oh, if you weren't Bombay fasting. Mix. Marcus, I don't remember the last time you even mentioned Bombay mix. Never had it before, but you know what I want to try? Bombay mix. <laughs> some hobnobs. This is a very flattering angle some for you bagels. guys. We just met a really lovely woman called Sam who actually works here in uh, Tesco's and she came and said hi and she watches my snaps. So I don't know if you watch my vlogs but it's really nice to meet you. We've uh, just been complimenting you as well afterwards. Um, but it's always nice when people say hi. It makes me feel all giddy. That we'd have to expect a lot this Ramadan. I knew there'd be a lot of obstacles that you know we'd have to come across, but it's actually happened. Chicken shop doesn't have any chicken. I know. Chicken shop ain't got no bloody chicken. Oh, oh. you're oh. a driver. Does not know how he works the clutch. Oh no, oh, we're stuck in a hill start. He failed. Oh, that's not his test. That'd be really sad. So yeah, we went to go get chicken and the chicken shop didn't have no chicken so we're not having any chicken. Well, we're gonna have to go somewhere else now. This is just, honestly, like, we, we, we know it happened to KFC, but come on. The halal chicken shop in Ramazan. In, in Ramazan. Oh. Ah. <laughs> we're getting delirious at this point. I think Marcus don't know how to speak anymore and I saw my eyesight is just like getting worse. I know. Come on, Lena Driver. You keep slowing down. Oh, Marcus, don't do that! Why are you slowing down so much? he's learning how to drive! Learn how to drive at the right speed limit. Lesson yeah. number one. That might be lesson number one. Drive the speed limit. <laughs> 20 miles an hour. This I'm is sick Ramadan. of it. I'm you need to, no, you need to be calm, okay? Have Sabur. Have Sabur. 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 Ah, Sabur. Ramzan, have Sabur. Ooh, 
does anyone get more frustrated when we shouldn't be in Ramadan than normal? I, 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 I've never realised how hangry I actually get. You do get really hangry, it's actually quite bad. But normally because I do it on my own, I don't think I've realised that I am hungry. Maybe your family just noticed and now I'm here to actually reflect on it with you and say look. But yeah, I realise when I'm angry with you, because I regret it immediately after. Ah, oh, that's nice. Like that's aggressively it. nice. You're cute. Hey, hey, hey. Okay. <laughs> You're so stupid. You're gonna get gonna. You're making someone nervous. They might have Rosa. He might be a perfectly good driver, but forgot how to drive. No, straight down. I'm gonna get some chicken. Cooking in someone else's house is the worst. So Iris has gone out, we decided we were gonna to come to sister's house, Kieran's house for if done. We had this really nice chicken pasta when we went to Turkey and Kieran wanted to try and recreate that. So I said I'd do it and while she goes and picks the kids up and does what she's gotta do. And I had no idea and still don't have any idea of where anything is. And the pasta dish I'm trying to make is essentially just a, a nice creamy cheese pasta with um, chicken, but we're mixing it up to, um, I'm gonna put some coriander in, some chili, some chili flakes, and see how that goes. So it's safe to say that I didn't sign up for this. I was here mid meal prep, and all of a sudden, Yay! Kieran decided she wanted to run errands. And without even telling me, drop her kids off. <laughs> Hello, put there. Hello, put there. What are you doing? Come on, see. Why do you look so shocked, Miney? Hmm? Oh, who is it? <laughs> and me! And you! So in here is just um, garlic, butter, salt and pepper. Nice and simplistic. Um, I'm just going to put this on now and then we'll come back to the chicken and the creamy sauce afterwards. Get some chicken for that? Yeah, so put it back in the fridge. I might not be as good as Irisa when it comes to making sure everything's filmed, but I'll give you the finished piece after I've done flicking it and killing. <laughs> you enjoy using my kitchen, Marcus? Yeah. It's nice to like, have all the pans in one cupboard. We got some dates today as well. Our neighbours just brought around some watermelon and some other bits. These dates are so much better than the ones you get in the shop as well. Look at how big and they, they are. And they go to charity. All the money, 100% anyone, as well. If anyone wants the detail, all the money goes to charity, all different charities. Wait, 100% profit. 100% profit. Ah. Ah. And you also get, that one's gone missing. Look at this, lovely oh, Ramadan activity book. Yeah, it's got so much in it to do for the kids. It's really, really nice. And it tells you a little bit about how the donations make a difference. And Miney. Nom, 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 Mine is open the rose up for all of us. <laughs> <laughs> I broke your daughter. Mine's opened the rose up for any of us. I'm going to show you we've got the chicken pasta that Marcus made. We've got some fat homemade chips. We've all ate the fruit. And then we've got some chicken wrap. You having chicken wrap, Z? Okay, we're going to sign out now because we need to eat. So, see ya. See ya. <laughs> see ya. See ya. There we go. See ya. <laughs> Maybe not. Where's Cinnabon? Where's Cinnabon? Right, thank me later. But if you've never had Cinnabon from Tesco, please get some and have it as your dessert after you've seen this vlog for your fast. Because, no, Tesco's not paying me for it, but they can pay me in Cinnabon if they want. Because this is the best thing you'll ever have. The best. The best. I have it cold, but you can have it warm. 
But on, no, say no more. Well, say no yeah, more. Yeah, just yeah, have yeah, it. Yeah, just go to just Tesco have it. and buy this and say thank you, Irsa, in the comments.